Okay, it's Mr. Southside Chronicle, 2300 block. Get that bag production. Another facts of light moment with the homie, you heard me? Big T3, baby, you heard me? Somewhere in the South, you heard me? If you know who, if you know, then you know, you heard me. But we gonna get up into this, you heard me? Real soon, real quick, you heard me? After these messages, you heard me? You heard me? Stop playing, man, with the homie, Big G3. Alright, kill me if I'm lying. Be Okay, 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 I'm back, I'm back. We about to get up into this shit real decent with the motherfucking Facts of Light moment by Mr. Southside Chronicles 2300 block. Get that bag production. I'm up in this bitch with Big G3, you heard me? But it's no more for another introduction, you heard me? We're gonna get off on that bitch, man. Let them know who you be, man. Y'all boy, know who the fuck you are, man. Big G3, man. Glizzy Gang Glow would be the motherfucking label, nigga. Y'all know who it is, man. Better known as X growing up in my hood if you really know me, you heard me? Used to be calling by the name of TBG Nino, you know, heard me? Still love, still my brothers, you heard me? Nigga know what it is, I bought stuff, got my own shit. You know what I'm saying? Right. The New Year. Right, right. So she... All right, all right, Big G3, man. Why don't you let the people know how long you've been a native of South Baton Rouge, Louisiana? Oh, 32. Yeah, you know what's going on? 32 years old, I've been a fucking Southside native since I was born. I'm from that beat. Yeah, right, right. 2010, Georgia Street, born and raised. Right there on my yeah, own. Yeah, stamped yeah. on his arm, you heard me? Stop playing, you heard me? You know what I'm saying? You must don't love your hood if you ain't tatted. Yeah, ain't got your little painted blood. You nigga, you ain't no fucking safe. All right, all right. I got all that right. bitch too tame. Alright. You know, baby, she say bottom boy, yeah. I mean that shit. I mean that shit, you heard me? So shit, man. I know, you know what I'm saying, from growing up in South Baton Rouge, a lot of people then took some losses. So some, what are some of the losses that you then laid up there and had to take growing up in South Baton Rouge? Some of the experience, just let the people know a, a little bit about, you know, your life, Big G3. You feel me? Alright, one second. I'm about to get to it right now. Alright, bet, bet, bet. Like you were saying, man, on them experience that you done laid up that man and, you know, then took place in your life in South Baton Rouge down there in that bottom, you heard me? To lay up there and elaborate a little bit. Oh, shit. Really the first experience that I had taking a loss was my mama. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That made me want to get over it. Yeah. So like I fought that shit up until I was nineteen. It happened when I was two. Right. Right. Yeah. Right. It happened when I was three years old. I had uh I was by my aunts. You know what I'm saying?
lot of people I ain't think I remember because I was like three. I was three for sure. Uh, and then you think like I remember the shit or whatnot. But like how I remember is when I walked to the door, I snuck. The police was doing some shit and I snuck out. Right. And when I snuck out, I walked to the front door. Right. When you walk in, she right there. And I kept saying, I'm like, Mom, I'm like, Mom, I'm like, Mom, come on. All right, let go. Come on, Mom. And she went, come on. Damn. Man, I know, bro. You know what I mean? I, I, I can see, you know, that it hit different, you know, because I have, me also, have lost my mama, you know what I mean? You feel me? But she just laid up there and had passed, you know, uh, about a couple of years ago. Telling some people today, X, I was like, man, I could get on here and jokes all day, but I ain't gonna lie, I ain't nothing that you could say gonna drive me, but still, don't say nothing about my mama, cause I'm gonna get off on your shit. Don't I'm play, like, don't you know, talk about my mama and my yeah, children. I'm not, yeah, 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 I'm not gonna play with nobody, mother. You know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna play with nobody, mother. You know what I mean? Like, uh, I don't play no games like that. You know, and then after that, you know they had Got uh, killed in the bottom edge. Yeah. You know what I'm yeah. What year that? What year that was when that? When that? And can't even remember, huh? But after but that, that when they, was my cousin Jab. Oh man, Jab man, say man for real man. This is a face of light moments. You heard me like I say man. We own this bitch with Big G3. Kevin Montreal Collins man was a real one man. You know what I'm saying? That's fucked up how that shit happened on Olinda Street up in that South man. But we all know who was supposed to have been the said, who had done that shit, you heard me? But it's an eye for an eye, two for a two phone. Every dog got his motherfucking day, you heard me? Real Southside Chronicles shit. But, man, don't you elaborate, man, the relationship that you had with your own people, man, your own cousin, man. Because Jab was a real one, real Southside shit. Man, me and Jab, every day, me and Jab, when he used to come from this house, this my shit. This one right. of mine, you heard me? Right. Man, every day when he used to come from around here, he'd come on up, over there to Georgia Street to my grandma's house and let you know I'm at. Right. He'd come to that second room, and as soon as he walk in, I could be playing somebody or in my own zone by myself. Right. He gonna make me get off that bitch. Huh, <laughs> this, huh, this is $25, bitch, get out the game. <laughs> come on, I won't play fight night. Yeah, you're right. Now, That's he young. don't know how to play. Right, right. But he want to beat me. Because I'm the one beating everybody. He want right. to beat me. So he can talk shit. Right, that's him. But he can't beat me. Don't try to piss and, out. And he too. straight grab a joystick. 
Now, you know, it's ways that you can play the game. Right. You grab a joystick, go tapping all the joysticks to fight, tapping all the uh, buttons just to fight. So, whatever punch they throw, that's what he do. Right, Fuck right, it. right. If you get knocked out, he do. If he right. knock you out, yeah. Right, right. I'll be jabbed about 12 times a day. Sometimes... DD will get on him about come on we finna go he'll make me come spend the night with him school, school night fuck it he ain't go right. to school right I'ma take him lying to my grandma right <laughs> I walked in and when I got that I walked over here in, on Kentucky Street yeah you're right and Jab Jab I walked there back though Jab was on his knee my cousin Brave was on the, on the stove dude. I already know bro that was a fucked up night, man, that night, man. I remember that like it was yesterday, though, you feel me? That was a fucked up night, man, you know? And shout out, man, to his family, man, to the rest of his family, man. Rest in peace, man, old jab, man. Real hey, talk. Bitch, Real hey, talk. Hey, yeah, payback, that, that payback on what they found. They got a song say, that payback on motherfucker. <laughs> payback. Hey, that hey, get back, yeah, that's what I was trying to say. That get back a motherfucker. They get yeah. back a motherfucker. Yeah. James. Uh, after that, <laughs> right. Yeah, man. I experienced something on my own. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Talk about it. Talk about it, man. Hey, man. Coming up, you had to get your respect in that beat. Right, right. It had the top and the bottom shit going on. You heard me, but like my brother from the top. Right. Please and fire. Right. Wits. Right. That's my bro. He from the top. He, he own that. He run that bitch. Right. You know, I got partners from the top. Right. You know Fredo. Sonny, right. You yeah. Know what I'm yeah. 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 Uh, Mike, nigga. Uh, yeah, real Rennie. chronicle shit. Rennie, you know right. Shout out to Rennie. Yeah. Uh, Mel. Yeah, male, I know. Yeah, male. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Right. Yeah, right. Yeah, that nigga male say I ain't doing no boss tripping. At all. <laughs> Mr. Griffin, nigga, you know why I'm living. <laughs> Southside, for real. Rest in peace, seven, man. We have lost a lot of young, a lot, a lot, a lot of, a lot of natives, bro, from this bottom, bro. You yeah, know what I mean? That what hurt me. I lost hair. Yeah, bro. That's who I was running with. First. Yeah, bro. For you real. I was running with Harold for some years. You know, some shit went down. Man. Yeah, man. Shit be crazy down here, man. And that I real crunch. First nigga let me see them M's, though. First one to let you see them M's, huh? Yeah, he had them. That's facts. You're getting the real facts of life moment, I'm telling you. Yeah, $150 million cash. 50 mil cash. I know. Yeah. I already know. I, I ain't, and, and, and who know? Who know? No, this ain't no cap. So, you know, I ain't like nobody capping, you feel me? This real who facts. No, no, it ain't. It, it, it definitely ain't cap coming from me. Right. I was with him. Big G3. Big G. They already so, know. They already know. I was the head of Small Circle Project. Stop playing. Yeah, that's the point I'm trying to get to, uh, man, for the people that don't know, you know. Been eating, retarded on the mic, you feel me? Whole family member, from, eat all down. Yeah, them, yeah, they retarded on that mic. Shout out to them four babies, too, you heard me? Uh, Stop playing. Babies, Shout out to them four babies, man. Uh, yes, uh, sir, man. But say, bro. Then, you know, after Harold, two days later, man, I lost G Money right in front of me. <laughs> Saying the first bullet knocked my phone from by my ear. You know what I'm saying? And when that bitch knocked my phone from by my ear, I was just talking to Big Son. You heard me? Rest in peace, Boulevard Dunn. You heard me? Big Boat. South Carolina. Right. You know what I'm yeah, C Street, 2300 block. Uh, so, you know, I'm dealing with him. Going my walk to the front, like, let me go check on G. You know what I mean? Cause the bitch just asked me to come home you know, for the weekend, but I'm like, no. Cause every time I leave and go home with you to shower, she got a sister, Millie or something. You know I mean? My baby mama see us on live. His baby mama ain't got me around. She don't think just cause I'm around Gia Fredo, I'm fucking somebody. Right, right. You know I mean? So, 
I'm like, let me go check on a lot of shit going on at the time. He was, you know, he wasn't green, but you know, he wasn't taking some shit serious. Right, right, right. I just had told him that. Shit, I walked outside, I grabbed for the door, the bullet hit me, BOW! That bitch knocked my phone from out, and I fell to the ground. Uh, boom, shots went out, about eight shots went out, and it stopped. I got up, I checked myself, I went outside, and I'm like, man, let me go check on GCMG, alright? Right. Got out there, G was laid out, stretched on the ground, you hear me? I'm like, fuck, I tried to pick him up. His bow was like, don't grab him, you might move the bullet. I'm like, man, I'm trying to save my son, man. Yeah. Right. I'm trying to see what's up. I'm like, gee, talk to me. Tell me something, you hear me? He, was, he tried to say something. And he was like, he just jerked with me, bitch. My eyes rolling, I just closed me, you know? I had a pillow, I tried to stop some blood from coming out the side because he ain't got hit inside. He ain't get hit in the head like how they were saying on the Let's say, bro, don't that shit be some weird ass shit? Cause nigga be acting like that shit don't be weird. That shit weird, bro, to see somebody that you fuck with or you love that you got love to see them stressed out. Right. You know what I'm saying, man? I don't give a fuck, man. That that shit ain't no shit that a motherfucker, you know, you get used to, bro. You know? Oh, we was very mad about it. Right, I know. Yeah, we was very mad about it. Yeah. For real, for real. Let's say, man. I ain't gonna go too long, bro. I just appreciate you coming through, man, and let that let me give me the opportunity to brother let that and have a conversation oh, with you. Good, you heard me, Big Go G3, like, bro? Cause niggas in the in, in this in this bottom in this south, I don't know what it be, man. Yeah. They they just be oh, like, I don't know what it be, niggas, bro. Yeah. You know, but I already know what it is. Always we ne we always been eye to eye. Mano to mano, man to man, bro. It's always been a respect thing from way back then and damn near watch you come up to and grow up. You understand me? But it's always been a respect thing, you know what I'm saying? From even when the vibe days and shit, as you say, when we were speaking on them small circle cartel days, you feel me? It's always been a, you know. Everybody get ready for the people who watch them. Yeah, let them know, man. My Instagram is at Gang three times. Yeah. Okay. Xavier Hunt is my Facebook. You heard me. The motherfucking mixtape on the way coming soon in about two to three more weeks. Y'all get ready, man. Scatter thoughts, volume one coming to y'all. Kill me on my line, bitch. Real. Man, I'm telling you, I'm gonna fuck with us. Send it to me. You know I'm gonna have this bitch all over that motherfucking gram and that goddamn YouTube and that internet when that bitch dropped, man. You heard me? I love them, girl. I just love the fact when I get rid of get down to sit down with one of my rounds and we do our shit, you feel yeah. me? And y'all give them the real, cause I know they, 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 they get tired of hearing it from me sometimes, yeah. you heard yeah. me? They get yeah. tired. That intro gonna be out tomorrow, man. I'm putting the intro to my CD, that Scattered Thoughts. I'm putting the intro out tomorrow. So scattered Thoughts, out. Scattered Thoughts. Act like y'all ain't kiss that. Scattered Thoughts. All right. All right. Yeah, man, but this is Mr. Southside Chronicles. 2300 block. Get that bag production. Facts and light moment. Man, you, you see him as his best, man. He's still in the stride, still looking good, still laying up there. Got motion going on, man. Big G3, man. Real south side. Step a bottom boy high up. Y'all won't call that shit. Yeah, you know stop playing. Alright. Y'all this bitch. What up, what up, what up? This your boy, Mr. Southside Chronicles 2300. I get that bag of ducks from Factor Light Moms. Hashtag, man. Kill me up on land, bitch! <laughs> but for real, for real, though. For the ones that live up there and watch my videos, you know, if you like my video, I got my cash app on here, you know what I mean? Man, send me a dollar or so, man. You know, because I'm really trying to get my business off the ground, you know. I've been working at it a long time. I'm not asking for no handout or nothing, you know what I mean? It ain't like I'm a charity case or nothing, but I'm just asking for support, you know, support my business, you know. It's a black business. I'm trying to get my little podcast, content, funny skits and everything off the ground, you know. And I swear to God, I promise you, you will be seeing the difference you know, and what I'm doing, you know what I mean? You just send a dollar, I promise you, you will see a difference in my work, you know, because I'm not going to stop, and I'm not asking, and I'm not begging, but I'm just saying, 
my cash app is on the front of the screen. If you like it, hit the bell. You understand me? Ding it. Like it. Share your comments. Everything. You heard me? It's Mr. Southside Chronicles 2300. Like, get that back to us. It's time to like, man. It's true stories. You hear me? Kill me if I'm lying.